Hey yo, hey guys and girls, what's going on? It's Funky. Welcome back to some more Season 7 WWE Supercard Early Access video. Now, in today's, it's one of the most requested things you guys have asked for, Super Moves. Now, we know a little bit about them. I'm not talking about Batman, I'm not talking about Superman, I'm not talking about Spider-Man, I'm not talking about The Flash, I could name loads. But I'm not talking about them, I'm talking about Super Moves in WWE Supercard. We're going to tell you how they work and show you how they work as well. So, in today's video, we're going to be talking about that. If you're hyped and you're excited for this, make sure to drop a thumbs up on this video. I have a lot of content coming over over the next couple of days make sure to drop a thumbs up subscribe to the channel to see it all first and make sure you follow me on social medias as well we have twitter instagram discord link down below along with those social medias we have a twi twitch sorry and a tiktok so all of those are linked in below in the description and the comment section now i usually run a today's champ thing but for these videos i'm just gonna have it as wwe supercar because they gave me early access so Shout out to you, WWE Supercard and 2K UK. Thank you for the early access. But I know what you're here for. You're here to learn about super moves. Let's get into it, shall we? Starting off with the help center because I'm going to read off and explain a little bit about it. And then myself and yourselves are going to learn about super moves. This is my first time learning about it. So I'll be learning with you. That's how it's gonna work. So it, let's hope it goes well. Uh, here we go, help center. I know exactly where it is because I had a quick read over this, but didn't really take a lot in. So, super moves. Super moves are another way for you to help your superstars take control of a match by triggering a massive boost that your opponents will not see coming. This is going to be very effective inside PVP modes like a maybe a, if you're playing like a PvP versus another player, maybe a war or something like that, you know. But to activate your super move, you must first fill up your super move meter. So you can't be using it when it's half full, it has to be full. Anytime you use a superstar in the ring, you'll earn a super move energy that will be added to your super move meter once your superstar meter is full you can activate your super move by tapping on the meter using your super move will empty your super move meter and then you can start building it up again very interesting when you use your super move the next card cards if it's a tag team you play will get a massive stat boost so i think of like a momentum slot but it gets a massive stat boost in terms of if it's going to make you a better card so you'll be able to maybe defeat the card that you wouldn't have been able to defeat now percentage wise i don't know so we'll have to pay attention to that make sure we're paying attention in the comments if you figure it out and i don't let me know you can save your super move for when you need that big win but once your meter is full you won't gain any more super move energy until you use what you have so keep that in mind if your super move is full and you decide look i'm not going to use this because i'm in a road to glory it's a tight game i want to save it for the final round when i really really need it this is important pay attention you need to use it or you're not going to gain more energy but you might not need to use it so good luck Let's see it in action, shall we? We go into one of the PvP modes and show it off right now. Let's see the super moves in action right now. This is the deck I'm going to use going into a male Royal Rumble game. We're going to see how often that super move bar moves up. We're going to see what it looks like when I eventually use it. Keep an eye out for how much those stats boost up when we do use it. But I'm expecting to get through this game without it filling up. Hopefully. Because the aim is to not use it and then use it when we can get a better idea of what the stats are. Because obviously in Royal Rumble, your stats go down because you get attacked. So, the aim is to get it boosted quickly by playing a Royal Rumble game. But then maybe go into something like War and I can show you off the super move better there. But let me know what you think of it and how often it moves up. And when and where you will decide to use it in the comments below. But let's get into the action. You're going to see how often the super move goes up. We're starting obviously with 0%. As you can see, we are on 0%. So we're going to start off with an Isaiah Swerve. And as soon as we use him, before we pick our next card, we will be able to show you how much it's moved up. So the super move bar is now at 2%. So it looks like 
it goes up 2% every time you use it. So keep that in mind when you're playing a Road to Glory or anything like that. It goes seems to go up 2% every time you use it. So toughness. There we go. See, I'm assuming they don't want these to be super effective. Again, another 2%. They don't want it to be abused, you know. They don't want someone going through a Road to Glory and using this every time they play a Road to Glory match. So I can kind of understand, but 2% is a little bit low. What do you guys think about the 2%? It seems a little bit low. Seems a little bit low for me. We'll see what it's on by the end of this Royal Rumble game, but 2% seems very 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 low we come up against a walter he is a pro so i'm going to lose the final game but that's fine we're going to win overall and we're on 36 percent after one game of royal rumble so what i'm going to do is i'm going to get full up to 100 percent i'm going to come back to you guys and then we'll show you how the super moves work so it's at 40 percent which is not bad that's one pvp game i've got up to 40 percent so realistically what you could do in between road to glories is you could back out play two pvp games and you already almost have it at 100 percent you know um that's not that bad so what I actually what i'll do is i'll go into a game of war and i'll see how much percent it goes up in war that's what I'm going to do. There's an EO Shirai Biomechanical. So I can back out off this screen. I don't have to get my picks now. There's EO Shirai. That looks fantastic. I believe I would have already shown you that. So what I'm going to do is now is I'm going to go into war. I'm going to see how much it goes up in war. I'd imagine it's still 2%. I can't see it being any higher. But I just want to give you guys an idea of what it's going to be like in the different game modes. And an Elimination Chamber. If it's 2% in this, it's going to be the same in Elimination Chamber. So we know that. War, I don't think I've put my best deck in. So you might not be seeing the best cards in this one. I apologize for that no i have i lied to you get trolled let's use the undertaker here against montez ford i don't believe i've shown you that montez so that's a new card for you to look at but there we go the undertaker should get the w and he does indeed we are on oh well let me hmm. there we go 42 i had to click it my bad okay so we're going into war we're currently on 98 percent in that super power power up we're gonna get a 200 and then we're gonna show you the effects of using it on one of our cards so are you excited and let me know down below but that cane looks absolutely amazing that image looks awesome i want that cane card so as you can see right here 96 percent. sorry my bad 96 percent. but either way we're still going to get to use it in this so roman reigns we're going to start off with it doesn't matter if we win or lose we still seem to get the percentage anyway so that doesn't seem to make a difference as you can see now we should be oh we're at 100 now my bad. So, the next card I pick, I will get it. I've used it, okay? Look at Bailey's stats. We're going to use it on Bailey right now. I'm purposely not going to use the support here because I don't want to mix everything up. We're going to pick Bailey. Look at the stats 4.9. 4. Look at that! Her stats doubled! Oh my god, her stats just doubled! What the hell? Okay. Okay, what? I was not expecting it to be like that. Yeah, uh, the two percent at a time makes sense now. I won't lie. The two percent at a time makes sense. Her stats just doubled. What? Oh my god. Oh look at this. She's gone Super Saiyan. Oh my god. Becky's about to get wrecked. Unlucky Becky. Get it. That was insane. Abs look at that animation. That looks so cool. That looks so cool. That looked so cool. Absolutely awesome. Wow. We need to show you guys one of them again, I think. Maybe on a mail this time. See how it goes. Let's show you some more of them. I've clicked it. Oh, here we go. Look, it's flashing. Right. Kevin Nash. Let's go. Let's find out what the stats do here. Do they double? Let's find out. Or why is that like a, a one and one chance thing? No, they double. Plus 100% to all stats. You've seen that. The superpower plus 100% to all stats. Oh my god, the card's nearly 10 million in stats. This is insane. Absolutely insane. I want to get that Undertaker in momentum. I want to get one on him. But we're going to win this easily, obviously. Angel Garza versus Kevin Nash. As you can see, they go Super Saiyan in the ring. And... What kind of... I've never seen Kevin Nash do that now. Won't lie. But that looks awesome. That looks absolutely awesome. Kevin Nash gets a W. Perfect game, obviously. But we're going to try to get one more saved up. Because I don't want to just do two. Let's try to get one more saved up. And I'll be able to show you guys that one as well. Are we going to pass 
10 million stats. It's time to find out. I have the superpower right here. We've clicked it. It's active. Pick a card. The Undertaker. Let's go. Come on. Let's see those stats. 10 million in three stats. 10 million in three different stats. That's insane. Absolutely insane. The Undertaker coming to the ring. The Dead Man versus Bronson Reed. Let's see what cool animation he has. He goes Super Saiyan. What's he doing? He's doing the same one we see Bailey do, is he? Uh, yeah. Uh, I want to see a tombstone there, I won't lie, but that looks absolutely amazing. But the 10 million stats. 10 million people. How many times do I have to say 10 million? 10 million. Insane. Uh, Kevin Nash, gotta, we're going to finish off this game, but that will wrap up the video on the superpowers. Let me know what you think about them. In the comment section below, have you enjoyed this video? Drop a thumbs up if you did. Make sure to follow me on Twitter, Instagram. Join my Discord. Follow me on TikTok and Twitch to keep up to date with everything involving everything I do. You can also make sure you hit subscribe to stay up to date with everything coming out on the channel. Now, let's finish off this game and that will wrap up today's video. I hope you all have a good day. Stay tuned to the channel for lots more Season 7 content. See y'all next time. Goodbye.